The year was 2022. A pandemic was destroying the world that we once knew. The pandemic was known as the situationship. And young people, the story went a little something like this. Huh. Sound like I'm about to do a R&B song or something. But I am smooth, that's why they call me Suave the Poet. But one thing about being suave is, you know, sometimes it comes with being a little toxic. I done had my days, I done been there. And I know all about toxic relationships and sexual encounters, so I know how they start. First he tells her, hey lady, how you doing? Cause he know that's what she wants to hear. But then it's fuck you, I hate you, because that's what she accepts due to the fear. They're frightening fear of men walking utterly out of a life. But who wants love, loves, and treating you right? You surrender your power to this man, giving him the upper hand. While the world has these demands of how to walk, how to talk, how to sit, how to stand. Never let a person tell you how to express yourself. That's like waking up in the morning not being able to dress yourself. And anything you do, don't do it for others, but impress yourself. Society pressures you to surrender your identity, to the vest of your name and make you a non-entity. Everybody concerned with what you can do for them, nobody concerned with who you are. So desperately, you cry silently, unhappiness leaving this ugly scar. Now when you lay down at night, you're content with this thought that you're useless. And when a real man tries to love you, send him through this maze of devastation, exiting so clueless. You lost sight of your value when it's really such a shame. Hey lady, you might have forgotten it, but I know your name. Then it transitions into, you was always pressed to protect yourself from a nigga that was never even gonna hurt you. But I understand a lot of niggas took advantage of your virtue and worked you with words that all led to dead ends and blurs. So you can't appreciate my old fashioned wanting to lavish you in fabrics because you made up your mind in the beginning when you listen to your friends telling you that I'm just a dead end. But I'm a road that doesn't end until life ends Because I'm one of the few still nice men Not one of these dudes thinking they're a wise man Trying to get in between your thighs and surprise You got something not to your liking It wasn't necessarily harmful, it just wasn't pleasurable Because he wasn't me Nobody ever know your body like me Because nobody ever loved you like me So the chance of you getting an orgasm from somebody else isn't likely That's why I'm just a phone call away when you looking for some more I come over, I do my thing, and then tell you I'm running to the store and never returning. Till my phone lights up with your name, then I come back and do the same. Because how you said nobody knows how to touch your body, I feel your pain. That's why when you call, I come. This is more than just a nut, this is a love chasm. But then it gets, it gets a little too deep in, and now it's just straight sex, and when it's not that anymore, what we gonna do? And now it just seems like the only times we grew stronger was when I grew stronger Because you sexually felt me But for my mental state you was never really healthy Because you couldn't help me Overcome my demons, fight my battles, burn my bridges, hop back on my saddle But you could always hop on this saddle So will we ever anything more than sex? I don't know but I don't have time to invest into that question Cause the only question we could ever answer is what position we gonna do next But nonetheless I don't think that you're less of a woman and I'm still a great man Together we just never had a plan The only thing we could plan for was the bed or the floor and I don't feel that anymore The only time you can get me high is when I'm high The only time I can get you right is if you right and that ain't right See you used to produce an array of wetness but you also produced a blessing And you taught me lessons about life and how to eat the plate right when we entered the sexualization shit, we messed up because I always left with a nut and all you got was my feelings all over your gut. And see, that ain't fair because I know how much you truly care and I care too. All the life lessons you taught me, but what did I ever do for you? Besides give you orgasmic feelings in the start and then with a broken heart. And the only way to numb the pain is to go back to the start, which always starts in the lights and ends in the dark. Shit, this one's smart. Memorize.